Alrighty, so Altibo is a programming environment for the Raspberry Pi that allows you to do bare metal programming in Object Pascal. Having a bare metal environment means that there's no operating system, so when the Raspberry Pi boots, it looks for a specific file on the SD card and just executes that. What this means is when you're debugging, every time you make a change, you have to take the micro SD card out of the Raspberry Pi, put it into adapter, put it into a PC, copy the file over, take the adapter out, take the SD card out of the adapter, put it back into the Raspberry Pi. This process will wear out your SD card and your patience pretty damn quickly. And the turnaround time is really not ideal. There are a few solutions. Some people have Wi-Fi SD cards. Some people come up with adapters. I think what I've done has been done before, but this is just my setup. So this is bare metal corner and I'll go through every single piece of equipment you can see. This is the Motorola Atrex laptop. It's basically a keyboard, a trackpad, and a battery. The idea was that you could take Motorola's Atrix phone, which has ports in the right places, and just dock it to this lap dock, effectively transforming it into a laptop. You have male micro HDMI and mini USB connectors, so it requires some adapters to connect to the Raspberry Pi. This is my Raspberry Pi 3. It's powered by a USB port. It's connected to Ethernet. It takes the USB keyboard and mouse from the lap dock and pushes its output over HDMI to the lap dock. You may have noticed that pin 18 is connected to ground. I'll go over that a little bit later. That's just my TP-Link Ethernet switch living on the edge like I do. This is my I promise I'm not sponsored TP-Link USB hub. It's powered and the best part about it is that it has a switch. Let's hit that switch now and power everything up. I wrote an updater unit that runs at the beginning of every single one of my applications. And what it does is try to connect to a web server that is just a normal Python command line running in the, the folder of my Altibo project on my PC. So when it boots, if pin 18 is connected to ground, it pulls down whatever kernel image it finds there, compares the dates to the one that it has on the SD card, and if the one is newer on the web server, it overwrites the current one, then reboots. On the second boot, the timestamps match, so it just carries on like normal.